I have been joined by Congress Party senior leader and member of Parliament in Lok Sabha, Mr. Manikam Tagore. Mr. Tagore, what has happened in uh, Punjab? Uh, now, the question marks have been raised on the state government as far as the Prime Minister's security is concerned. Honorable Prime Minister's visit in to Punjab has had changes in the last minute because of the because of the weather conditions and others. Therefore, the change of travel plan has created some kind of confusion. And farmers are protesting. We have to accept that farmers in Punjab are protesting against the central government, particularly against uh, the Honorable Prime Minister. Therefore, making these kind of things with the people's voice and you when they are protesting, making it into a political issue is completely not right. Mm -hmm. And we should not make politics into the Prime Minister's security also. And every leader in India is very important. And we, Congress Party, always takes care of the uh, security of the leaders. We are not like Mr. Amit Shah who reduced the security of uh, for the Congress leadership also. And therefore, we are very concerned about the uh, security of Prime Minister, but it should not be do, done in a political way. What is the political angle in it? Because we are seeing that there is this war of word which has broken between Congress and the BJP. Uh, Prime Minister while leaving has said something uh, that uh, say my thanks to the Chief Minister, I am going back. BJP has gone all out, attacked the Congress party. India's only Dalit Chief Minister is Mr. Cheney. Mm. And he has not been given adequate time also. He has just become Chief Minister and is doing a wonderful job. And the BJP leadership's mindset towards the only Dalit Chief Minister in India, he is the only Dalit Chief Minister in India, he is completely, un uh, shows their mindset. Mm. Because he is, he is as far a uh, for it, and they should be very concerned about the prime ministers. We are also concerned about prime ministers' security, hmm. and uh, the ANI has only reported it. It is not uh, prime minister has told thank you to CM and others. Hmm. It is ANA has only reported if Prime Minister, I don't feel that Prime Minister will stoop to this level to do your politics on the security part. My uh, question again, another one is related to Supreme Court. Now the matter has reached Supreme Court as far as Prime Minister's security is concerned, SPG, protectee, and this happens. This this has to be the Home Secretary, Home, Sec, Home Minister's work. Mm. And it has gone to the Home Minister, Mr. Amit Shah, should be answerable to it. Mm. And... Uh, because BSF has the control of 50 kilometers into the border area of the thing, it is falls under the BSF limit also. BSF directly reports to the Swamish Shah. Therefore, insert uh, court. Uh, somebody can go to court, and court has to do uh, what they have to do. It let them do it. But the answer lies with Mr. Swamish Shah's capacity as the uh, Home Minister of India. Well, my final question is, how do you think, uh, how do you see the things panning out? Because there's a lot of uh, um, attack from the BJP side. We saw yesterday Union Minister coming out and going all out. Now, Niruttam Mishra, a senior uh, leader as well as a minister in Madhya Pradesh of BJP, has gone out and said that uh, Congress President has to break the silence. No, this BJP fellows, particularly from the RSS, always speaks. Un unconnected thing and the real issue is about the farmers uh, protest in Punjab and Punjab is going for elections there there are 70,000 chairs were there for Prime Minister's um, uh, rally but there was only 700-800 people were there the media only reported it before the rally has become a flap and uh, people understand that BJP is finding it very difficult in Punjab and uh, you sh as usual BJP leaders will try to divert from the real uh, anger of people in Punjab. Well, that was Mr. Manikam Tagore speaking to us with the journalist Abhishek Supriya Bhardwaj for India Today in Delhi.